What are uncertainties? There are two types of uncertainties, the absolute uncertainty and the relative uncertainty. Relative uncertainties that are in relation to the object that is being measured, while absolute uncertainties are uncertainties of the entire shape that is being measured. To uh, calculate uh, the relative uncertainty and the absolute uncertainty, you have to calculate the true value first and then calculate the uncertainties. If the, no if the numbers are being added or subtracted, add the actual and um, absolute uncertainties. If the numbers are being multiplied or divided, add the relative fractional or percentage uncertainties. To define the relative uncertainty, you need the absolute uncertainty divided by the true value. Now, let's add and subtract uncertainties. When adding or simplifying uncertainties, we must first find the perimeter of our object. Depending on its shape, the formula for this varies. However, if the formula requires you to add or subtract, then add the absolute uncertainties. This gives us our absolute value. Then, we use the formula seen on the board to find a relative uncertainty. Now, I'm going to ask that you try this on the shape shown on the screen right now. Please pause the video. How do you use uncertainties when you multiply or divide measurements? First, I'm going to show you the basic steps that you have to follow when doing multiplications and divisions of numbers with uncertainties. Is here is a box. Two questions are asked with Charles to find the volume and to find the absolute and relative uncertainties of the box. So here are the steps that you want to follow to find the answers of the questions. First, to find the volume, you just have to use the volume formula, which is base multiplied by height multiplied by length. Then for the second question, which is find the absolute and relative uncertainties, there is a formula which says that if the formula requires you to multiply or divide, then add the relative uncertainties. That means that you have to find the relative uncertainties first. And to do so, you have to take the amount of, it, of uncertainties in each measurement and to divide it by the measurement. So that means if the box has 24 centimeters of base and 0 0.2 uncertainty, you're going to take 0 0.2 and to divide it by 24. You have then to do that for the length, the base, and the height, because that they are the values that you're gonna you're using to find the true value, which is the volume. Then, then you add the numbers together, and you get the relative uncertainty. To find the absolute uncertainty, you just use a formula, which is absolute uncertainty equals to relative uncertainty multiplied by value, the true value. Please find the true value and the uncertainties for this prism. 